Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Laysen for all the Sun, Moon and Rising um, Sagittarians. This is a week of a lot of changes. We have the Energy Vibration of the Major Arcana. We have the Energy Vibration of the Fire in the two first days of the weeks. I want to say thank you for your support. Thank you for your likes and shares. Um, please listen to your Sun, Moon and Rising sign and listen to the year, the monthly reading. Of the month of August because we have five weeks and we're now at the fourth week there is a situation with the love is in this week um, the energy vibration of strength your own energy vibration is also here in this week on Sunday whatsoever is happening there is um, a situation of pleasure um, on Monday so good news is going to come in on Monday whatever the situation is and the major arcanas are really here so the major arcanas are working with you guys the week begins from the 21st until the 27th and it's the week of strength which is a, a, your week is a week of strength so whatever the situation is you have to find in a strength as we move further and we're looking at energy vibration what you're going to be working with and focusing is the energy of the magician and the energy of the magician is uh, the energy where there are um, different um, situations that is going to arise and you're going to find the means of resolving these situations so it's going to be positive in a, a lot of sense of things okay so this is good so as we look at this week and we try to understand with all these major corners in this week there's a lot of major corners a lot of spirit guides a lot of openings where you're going to connect with yourself and connect with other things the overcrowning of this week is going to be the ancient the en energy of the lovers whatever the situation is with the energy of the lovers you're going to see changes happening in your life in whatever way okay so let's think about it and let's show the energy of certain aspects and certain things that will be coming out let's look at what else will be coming out there's a lot of source energy mm. yep 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 okay okay let's see oh boy hmm. we have the eight of swords in reverse so whatever situation that was there with a uh, um with soul family is going to be clear up we have another six of swords in reverse so whatever negative things that was there is leaving with the energy of the the lovers there is a situation where you're not seeing eye to eye the energy of the hermit um, some people are going especially um, the people who are between the ages of 18 and 35 there's going to be you have a situation with the Prince of Swords and you're looking within there's a situation of happiness which is wonderful because there's a lot of love in things and there's a lot of situation that is happening the energy of inner strength with the organization is going to be there so it's going to be a week for you that you're feeling as if you know you're out of energy but what the energy of the magician is saying is that you have everything that you need to um, you know change the energy vibration and whatsoever the situation is okay so let's look at this there is no specific number for you guys in this week it is a week of so many things that are happening um, in your life it's, it's it's a week of a real strange week for you Sagittarians on Monday we have the six of cups so we have a situation with a, um, a, a family situation this can be a cosmic family or this can be a situation of um, people who you know from past life okay whatever the situation is you have the seven of swords in reverse okay so whatever that was happening and someone um, of a past life or a past relationship that was trying to steal something away from you it's not going to happen okay be aware of this because you can have people who comes in your life for certain things and for certain um, that they want information or that sort of a thing so be aware whenever the seven of swords comes up it can be someone trying 
uh, was trying to steal something away from you but it's not going to happen okay so be aware of this situation as we move forward we have the energy vibration of uh, um, temperance whatever the situation is there is a, a situation that you have to have balance this is an earth energy this is the energy that you're going to connect with um, the the Virgos is a situation that you have to deal with the, the Virgos you have the nine of swords in reverse nine of swords in reverse you have no worries over the situation whatever it is with this Virgo person there is you know you you're not worried about it it's as if you know I'm safe and protective in whatever it is I'm not going to worry about the situation whatever may work out and whatever the outcomes will be it, it's going to be okay with me the crowning of the week is a week that has to do with love relationships okay there's definitely something going on here because you have the nine of cups in reverse so a lot of people um, there will be conflict in your intimate relationships a lot of conflicts in your intimate relationships a lot of conflicts in your own life and um, there can be an um, there can be a situation where interference is coming in so be aware of this whatever the situation is be aware because there is I, I feel in interference is coming in um, your relationship so be aware of the situation um, know that that is happening whether or not people are telling the truth or not it is happening as we look at the energy vibration of uh, the hermit the energy of the hermit is a positive one because the hermit is helping you to look within there is someone especially the people between the ages of 18 and uh, 35 that is you know considering uh, situations and you're looking at yourself and looking at situations some people this is going to affect some people who are within that age and some people are going to be reflecting on someone who is at this age you know and this is this is very good because it could be that you're thinking about your child who is between the ages of 18 and, and, and 35 and you're reflecting on certain things um, you know sometimes is is, is your child um, you know on the right part in their life that sort of a thing but whatever the situation is it's going to be a time of reflecting on Thursday on Friday we have the energy vibration of the um, Prince of sword whatever this energy is of the Prince of sword you're going to see that a situation has to do with the energy of the hermit the hermit comes up twice in this week so it's going to be a lot of inner inner reflection a lot of inner reflections that's on Thursday and Friday a lot of inner reflections and these have to do with people between the ages of 18 and 35 so whatever is happening with these group of people or whoever you have connection with who is um, a Harry's um, Aquarius a Libran or a Gemini you you know you start to, to look at situation and uh, to, to try to figure out situations about this whatever is happening okay so that's a sword energy on Friday on Saturday is a positive day you have happiness the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are coming through and whatever it is you're balancing now whatever emotional upset that was in this week for some people your wishes and dreams are coming true that you're moving on to something better some of you will find out that the relationship that you're in people weren't being honest and this is going to be good for you because you're going to realize that it is time that you make a change and you release certain people out of your life as we move on we have the energy vibration of inner strength with the organization whatever the situation is um, in an organization you have to find inner strength in some ways you really have to find inner strength whatever that has been going on whatever that has been taking place in your life you have to find inner strength with the organization by finding inner strength with this organization you're going to be aware of what is happening around you okay so as I look at this week this week has to do with it's going to affect your um, 
your love life with your partners which um, whether you're married whether you're having uh, an intimate relationship with someone whoever you're having an intimate relationship with there is seems to be a situation that is going on in your life this it's all about love this week this week is governed it's is the crowning of your week and whatever that is happening and you know whenever people are dishonest and when whenever um people are not telling the truth and whenever people are being slight and that sort of a thing you're going to see that um, the universe is going to come in and bring information to you and this is exactly what is happening in this week there's a lot of situation that is going to affect the people between the ages of 18 and 35 and it has to do with the cancers the fish and the scorpions okay that's on Thursday you're going to be thinking about these people and how they affect your life it could be someone at your work will be coming in with love to you and on Friday you'll have to deal with the hair sign people who is uh, Aquarius a uh, Libra or a Gemini so all of these things are playing out as we look further um, it's all about balancing certain emotions but you know the best thing about it is that on a Saturday you will realize something and you will decide to balance out your emotion and move away from someone who is not being very um, honest in your life okay service whatever is happening service is going to be very important so um, a lot of you are going to be changing careers and looking for ways how you can be a service to other people it is um, a very good thing to do because you're going to choose to see how you can be and play a better role a better part in someone else's life okay not thinking about yourself but trying to um, 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 heal a certain aspect of your life okay so this is good as we look forward I'm asking you whatever questions you'd like to ask ask your question and this will be the answer choose a new direction choose a new direction okay this is good because what this is saying is that um, the energy of the lovers with a nine of cups in reverse um, someone isn't being honest in their relationship so your partner could be the one who is not honest in your relationship if you feel as if there is a situation that you don't you're not feeling comfortable with your your intuition is telling you something listen to your intuition because it's always 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 correct okay whatever the situation is listen because the hermit wants you to go within and start to listen and connect yourself to certain things because if you feel if you're feeling that something is in balance it is always in balance whatever is going on it is um, something of imbalance and um, choose another direction meaning that um, make the choice and move away some people are going to choose um, different partners remove away from a relationship some people are going to choose a new um, uh, a new um, service to something and choose something else in your life choose a different direction because there is something um, and, and, and I'm, I'm getting it that it has to do with relationship it's like somebody is not being honest in their relationship um, if you feel that your partner is not being honest if you feel that there is someone else a third party in your relationship there is so listen to your intuition because this is what is coming in for myself too um, uh, sometimes people are not being honest and um, if you're you're if you you know sometimes you're getting it and sometimes you don't want to you're thinking no maybe it's just me and something is going on there okay so ladies and gentlemen boys and girls thank you for being here and we will talk next week